Hello there. Today we're going to be talking about the terms long ago and today. Just to review, the term long ago is also called the past or the olden days. In fact, when you use the term long ago, it means that it happened long before you were even born. Many modern things, things that you use in your everyday life, weren't even invented yet. The term today is also called the present or modern times. In fact, the term today means that it's happening right now or in the recent past, such as around the time your parents were born. The term today means life as you know it right now. Over the next few slides, you will be given a situation and you will need to decide the correct answer that best finishes the situation you've been given. Under each answer choice, there is an exercise. To choose the correct answer, you'll complete the exercise that's under the answer choice you choose. The first one is on the screen right now. It's getting dark. You want to add light to your room to finish reading your book. Long ago, you would have used, if you think long ago, you would have used the first picture, do jumping jacks. If you think long ago, you would have used the second picture, do cross crawls. Keep exercising until the correct answer is shown on the screen. All right, friends, long ago, you would have used the first picture. It's a lantern, so you should be doing jumping jacks. You would not have used a lamp, which is the second picture long ago, because a lamp requires electricity, and long ago, electricity hadn't been invented yet. Let's do another one. You need a ride to school. Today, you would ride a, if you think it's the first picture, do jumping jacks. If you think it's the second picture, do cross crawls. Remember to keep exercising until you see the correct answer on the screen. To get a ride to school today, you would ride a school bus. So you should be doing cross crawls. Would it be possible for you to ride a horse to school today? Sure, but the most likely answer would be a school bus. Here's another. You're getting dressed for school. Long ago, you would have worn if you think the clothes you would wear to school long ago is the first picture, do jumping jacks. If you think the second picture shows clothes that you would have worn long ago, do cross crawls. Long ago, you would have worn clothes similar to those in the first picture. You should be doing jumping jacks. The second picture shows clothes that you might have on right now. Let's do another. You go inside a classroom. Long ago, it looks like, if you think a classroom long ago looks like the first picture, do jumping jacks. If you think long ago, the second picture shows a classroom. Do cross crawls. Long ago, you would see a classroom that looks like the picture that is shown above the jumping jacks, that first picture. 
Friends, the reason the second picture couldn't have happened long ago is because most of the things in that second picture require electricity. And remember, electricity hadn't been invented long ago. See if you can see some things in that second picture that use electricity. I see a smart board, I see a projector, I see overhead lights. All of those things require electricity. Let's do another. It is Saturday and you want to play a game. Today you would play, if you think the first picture shows a game you would play today, do jumping jacks. If the second picture shows a game you would play today, do cross crawls. The second picture shows a game that you would play today. You should be doing cross crawls. The game is being played on a computer and computers hadn't been invented long ago. Let's try another. You walk home from school. Long ago, your house may have looked like, if you think it would have looked like the first picture long ago, do jumping jacks. If you think it may have looked like the second picture long ago, do cross crawls. Your house from long ago may have looked like that first picture. You should be doing jumping jacks. If you take a look at the second picture, I see a lot of lights that use electricity. In fact, if you look really close, you can see cars. Remember, cars hadn't been invented long ago either. All right, my friends, it's time to change things up just a little bit. You will see many pictures fly onto the screen. When you see something from long ago, do a squat. If it's something from today, just stand. Let's give this a try. Ooh, you should be standing. Transportation from long ago, you should have done a squat. Clothing from long ago, you should have done another squat. A television, you should just be standing. A stove from long ago that didn't require electricity. You should have done another squat. Cars. You should just be standing. Transportation from long ago. You should have done another squat. Now let's pause for just a moment. Do you see ships that look like that today? You sure do, but most of the ships from long ago look like that. Most of the boats that we use today require electricity or an engine. And let's do one more. An airplane is from today. Remember, long ago, airplanes hadn't been invented yet. All right, my friends, this is a special challenge. I want you to take a few minutes to walk around the room that you are in right now, only if you can safely do so. I want you to also count to see how many things you see that could have been used both long ago and today. Once you finish doing that, I want you to have a healthy rest of your day and always keep your eyes open, looking for things that could have been from long ago and today. I hope you enjoyed this activity and keep counting.